motorcycle adventure tours in Tanzania. These guys will take you off the beaten track and allow you to discover the scenic and authentic beauty of Tanzania. In Tanzania you can experience huge variety of people with the cultural life, also beautiful landscape and a lot of wild animals. Riding your motorbike among the wildlife is a unique experience. For example, in the trails that we ride, there's plenty of zebras and giraffes. Tanzania truly is the heart of the Africa. We have been riding through the most amazing African landscapes. There's been highlands with green vegetation and lowlands with dry areas. We've seen mountains, savannas, desert sand, sand tornadoes, grass plains. We visit the national parks and see things such as Mountain of God and the Hall of God. This is the Hall of God, which was created by volcanic depression. This means when two continental plates drift apart, it creates a sink and then this hole to the ground. This is the Mountain of God. It is a 2800 meter high active volcano. When you ride the remote parts of Tanzania, it is very crucial to have a good tour guide your tour guide is the connection between you and the local people. We know the language and we know of beaten truck. We have stopped now in a local petrol station. It's one dollar, one liter. And soon from here we're going to have lunch and off we go. Our tour manager Alpha is 100% Tanzanian and he has also worked as an African tour guide for most of his life. If there is a mechanical challenge, there is always a solution. So Alpha, what do you think has happened? The local is just gone, so we have to tow each other to get to the lodge and then we're going to fix it uh, from the local shops in, here, in the street. This morning we have arrived to a local mechanic shop and we are welding the sprocket now to the drive shaft. We're putting fuel, then we are riding to Malambo, 70 kilometers from here and then we are going to Lake Natron later after that. And if the first solution doesn't work, Africa offers always another solution. So Alpha, what has happened? Same problem, sprocket has broken again. So our Rastafari welders on the previous village did not reinforce the sprocket to the drive shaft. But in Africa there's always another village, another welder and another solution. This time we're gonna put an iron rod to the sprocket so it will make it indestructible. So now it will last for 200 years, this sprocket. Is it now unbreakable? It's now unbreakable. 